What's up, guys? We're here. Welcome back to the channel. So we're back again with another Dragon Ball Fusion World deck tech video and showcase. Today, we're bringing you Gohan. I know I'm a little bit behind the curve, guys. I've only been playing for a little bit, but I have been absolutely addicted, and we're climbing the ranks. So today, I have a Gohan here, um, Green Gohan. We have all the decks, and we're still going through all of them, but I kind of wanted to go over Green Ramp Saiyan Gohan because, to me, it's just slightly better than... Broly in a number of ways. I mean, but Broly does have the 25k um, beat stick power level, which just makes it hard to swing into him. And the decks are pretty similar in this sense, but the uh, there's just a slight difference. I think there's a little bit more versatility with Gohan. I think he's just better a little bit. And you don't go to three life, you go to four. So uh, let's go over the edit real quick and just talk about a few things. So of course, we got normal Gohan here. We're going to flip and we have uh, Awakened Gohan. So once per turn, you can activate or battle. So you can do this on your opponent's turn as well as your turn. Place one energy in your drop and the card gets 15k power. So it becomes a 35k beat stick, which is really good in the mirror matchup, especially against Broly. So uh, the idea of the, of the deck, like all green decks, is just to ramp up. And we're going to use a lot of ways to do that, a lot of cards. So we have uh, Sun Goku here. We're just going to draw a card to help filter our hand. We have Sun Gohan Childhood because we want to look and reveal a Saiyan with five costs or less and a special traits and add it to our hand. This is just a way to just, we really just need to search and get to the cards that we want, which is why we're also running uh, two drop Android 18 with 20K power. You draw a card, then discard, just another way to filter that. But when you're attacking at six or more energy, you just draw a card for free. This card is absolutely busted. So uh, I'll talk about why I want to go up to four to this in just a second. Um, we are rocking three of the two drop 25k uh, power trunkses. Now, this card can't attack your opponent's leader, but this is really just good for the yellow or orange. I keep calling it orange, but I guess it's yellow. It's good for the yellow matchups against Frieza and Cooler because when they just lay out the Ginyu uh, Raccoon package and they drop three 20ks, they really hate seeing trunks when you're playing green. So he just kind of. Uh, like stalls that out and then having a 10k combo power is really really strong we got the best four drop in green that is vegeta here um on play this is a self awakener um and or not a self awakener excuse me this is one of our rampers we're going to add a card from our drop with three or more to our energy and rest mode and then once per turn we could discard a card and just get rid of you know pesky two drops super strong it's only a 20k power which kind of sucks but we really just using him to to ramp up and 10k combo power is really good too Next, I have Sun Gokus. Okay, these four drop Sun Gokus. Um, I would only run two of these. I would love to run just two of these and then go to four of the Android 18s, but I don't have a fourth one. So right now we're rocking three because it is a 10K combo power. We want as many of those in the deck as we possibly can get. Uh, it is a 25K beat stick at four, which isn't bad, but on play, we can add a card from our hand to our energy. So we can actually help ramp us just a little bit to help get to six and seven, but really you're basically just using this to combo. Next, we're going with four of the Sun Gokus with uh, Mr. Cell there. He's only a 5K combo, but this is uh, one of the main cards in the deck. When we play this or when we place a card from our drop uh, in place in your drop from your energy, you add the top. So this is just constant um, ramping for Gohan and just green. We all know about that. Then we got five drop Gohan, 30K, 10K combo power. This is really, really good. So if we don't draw into one of our six drops or seven drops or Broly, like this is actually pretty good because besides the five drop, like Frieza, Goku, and Vegeta that have double strike or even the androids, like this Gohan is not only 30K power and just stalls out, but we get rid of something that is a four cost or less on your that your opponent has. And it's a 10K combo. So this card is really... Is really undervalued. I don't find myself playing it a whole lot, um, like in the matchup, because once you ramp and get enough cards, like you end up playing droids or something like that instead. But this card can really come in uh, clutch. Next, we're rocking three of the Android 17 and 18 Double Striker. This is really just in here to help close out games. And on play, we get rid of two of our opponent's cost, uh, like two of their three drops, which just helps helps green really stabilize since we're spending all of the early game and like part of the mid game ramping so this just helps us really reset and again i like three of these over like running four brolies because this just resets the board it's two less um energy and it's only 5k power less than broly um 
Next, I'm rocking four of the six drop Sun Gohan Childhoods. 35k, only 5k combo power, but on play, add the top card of your deck to your life. Super, super powerful here. There's not going to be many times that we do just play this card, but playing this once in a matchup can really just change the entire dynamic of the game. Like being at three and then adding this and going back to four to where we're really out of range from our opponent's double strikers is just huge. Uh, I'm running one of the secret rares, just Sun Gohan. This is just a one of, I think some people keep talking to me about making this a two drop. Like if you can run one, you can run two. So with this, it's just a complete reset. You drop this, destroy everything five or less. So unless somebody's playing like six drop Goku Black or Broly, um, this really just wipes the board and you just stabilize. Of course, four super combos with King Vegeta. Don't run Yamcha, run King Vegeta always. And then I'm rocking two Broly's just to really close out the game. Now, if I was worried about like the mirror matchup with, you know, an opposing Gohan or just playing against Broly, I'd maybe run three. But I think that Gohan is a little bit better in those matchups against Broly. So I'm only rocking two, but there an argument could be made for three. We are rocking two instant Kamehameha's at the zero cost drop just to help close out games. We're rocking two of Gigantic Meteor. This card is just absolutely insane. 25k power added. It's just it's just bonkers. Uh, and then we're rocking four of the destructive strength to make sure that we can ramp. I have tested this with three guys, and three just seems fine. But I won't because we're not we're not doing like the Paragus package, or what is it, like this. We're not rocking um, Moa to look at the top five cards and then pull an extra card. So because we're not rocking Moa, uh, I decided to opt for four to give us a better odds at like just drawing this, right? So that is the deck, guys. We're going to go in and do a matchup and just see how it goes. Um, I really like this deck. Obviously, there's a lot of room for change. The first change I would make is drop one of the Sun Gokus for another Android 18. Um, and after that, like, it's pretty solid. I kind of dig it. There's not really any other changes I would make. So um, let's go over here. We're going to go into a rank match and play some Sun Gohan and uh, just have a have a blast. Ooh, against Orange Frieza. Okay. This, this I want to go second. Come on. Let me go second. We're the second player. Sweet. Okay. Um... This is a weird hand with the Gohans. I'm going to change. Bam. That's what we were looking for. Destructive strength. But we got our... Oh, my God. This is a weird, weird hand. Oh, my God. My I have no turn one play. No turn two play. Ugh. He's going to be pretty aggressive here. What's up with all the extra cards I keep drawing? Um, Charge... Oh my god, I drew a Broly. What is this deck shuffling? What is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> However, Gohan is very, very good against uh, yellow. These I might have to just dump one. I don't know if I... I kind of want to keep the Broly, but... Draw Gohan, please. Multiple subclasses together. Interesting. I mean, this isn't bad. Okay, so he's setting up. So right now he has two Frieza clan or Frieza army. So he's setting up next turn for the uh, the big play. So let's just charge this. Um, we have to do destructive strength. So we have to do that because we have to ramp into Vegeta. Perfect. Yeah, like you you want to go into destructive. So this is what we do. We go into destructive strength here. Yep, we add the top. And then we're gonna play. Then we're gonna play um. I think we're just gonna we're just gonna play Goku, I think, instead of Gohan. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Uh so we're not in the worst possible spot, but I mean. Dude, that's crazy good. I'm actually quite surprised that he let's see. So he's gonna play he's gonna play he's gonna play Raccoon, then play Genyu, then play something else. So he's gonna have one, two, three, four, because Jace will get above five attackers. Uh let's just super combo him away now. 
Because what's great is next turn we can play Vegeta and kill two of them. So that'll be nice. But if we can just get to Gohan, we can stabilize. Oh, he oh he didn't have Raccoon. Okay, so he just has... All right, that's not bad. Birder. Okay, interesting. No Raccoon. No attacks. What is this? This is super weird. All right, we're going to check the Gohan. Super weird, man. We'll just play Vegeta. Oh, thank God I had I, I had destructive strength in there. I always got to check to make sure I have a three drop. Um, we'll attack into Frieza and just zero out. I'm guessing he wants to flip, but the longer he stalls, the like. Um, what should we get rid of? I don't know if we'll need this Gohan because we have the other Gohan. So I think we'll just discard this and we'll just get rid of this guy because he's, he's annoying. Um, we're not going to attack because unless he self awakens, we're actually in a really good spot right now. I'm not sure why he's not being aggressive. I know he wants to flip with Frieza, but I'm I'm not sure why he's not being aggressive here. Let's see, what does he have at four? He has 40k Frieza, or he has cooler. Um, we can afford to take this hit. This is okay. This is fine. Oh my God, androids are so bad for him. Yeah, androids are so bad for him. So he'll put this in rest mode. What is he doing? What is he doing? I am so confused. John, what's up, man? Yeah, our Lions draft was pretty good this year. Um, I honestly think I'm going to get rid of the instant Kamehameha, but I could just get rid of one of these. Yeah, I'm going to I'm going to get rid of the oh, gosh, man. I'm not really sure what to get rid of. I guess I could charge this. I'm going to be honest, like I just want to I want to play this and just go to work. Instead of playing this, I almost want to just play this and clear his board. I honestly think that's the better play. Or what we could do is we could play this, survive the following turn, and play Gohan, and then wipe absolutely everything. That might actually be better, because then we could we could go into Broly. Yeah. Let's see here, though. If he self-awakens, he's going to swing at me with one, two, three, four. I mean, you know what? I'm going to play this. I'm going to play the little bit safer route here. We're going we're gonna to get the ramp, which is fine. So next turn, we can play Broly if we want. Um, I don't want him to awaken, so honestly, what I think I could do is I could just discard and destroy another one of his drops. Do I need to do that though? If he plays an if he plays a third thing, yeah, we might just skill this. I don't think he has a way to deal with my card, so I'm just gonna get rid of the instant command Maya. I'm gonna dump his um, his his Ginyu here. Because Vegeta is just gross. He must not. He must not have drawn any self awakeners. This is weird. He could play Freeze at five, which would be interesting. But next turn, now we have Broly. We have Broly, Sun Gohan, or we could just play Androids and just destroy everything. To be honest, I think the play next turn is Broly anyway, but um, let's see. So we go to four, we go to five, four, three. I don't think he could kill us if we don't want to do anything, but I will take the hit. I'm okay with this. All right, that's not bad. We can actually play this. <clears throat> okay, so he rested my guy. This is going to give me 25k, so I actually survive. 
Yeah, we we let's not take this hit. Yep. As much as I want to awaken, he hasn't played anything yet, so I'm kind of just like waiting to see what he what else he plays. I think he wants to try to see if he can get us down to play Frieza, but no, so he could play something else. I don't know why he hasn't been so aggressive. This is weird. You guys let me know down in the YouTube comments. Because this is this is unusual. So he sacrificed the one drop. Do we care about Vegeta anymore? He's destroyed two of their stuff. I think we just let it go, right? Yeah. Okay, Vegeta. You've done you've done your job. You ramp doesn't kill two of his things. You did you did you did great. I don't know what he's trying to do. Okay, so there goes three drop. Ooh, well, um, let's charge. Let's charge this. Okay, so now now we have a now we have a thing. We have a thing. So we could either play Broly, blow this up, like blow up his cooler. And then swing tight twice and wipe his board. Or we just play Gohan and wipe everything. Or we can play this and destroy two of his three drops, which would be this and this. Hmm. I think we just play... I almost want to play Gohan here. Because if we wipe his board, he can't really do anything. Let's play Gohan. Let's just wipe his board. We'll discard a card from our hand. We'll discard this Gohan. Bye-bye, board. You don't get to do anything. And then we'll swing for free. <clears throat> Now he can awaken. Um, I think I think this has done its job. So I don't even care about it anymore. I don't think he has a way to beat us. Because if we swing and we get him to four. You know what? No, I'm not going to attack. I'm just going to enter. Because next turn, I think with this 50k in my Broly, I think we just win. I, he doesn't have a way to, to do anything to us. Even if he played Frieza. Yeah, John, the Lions draft went pretty good this year, man. Our front office is pretty pretty solid. Because at six, they don't really have anything. Unless he's playing something really weird. But I don't know why he wasn't being super aggressive. Um, This we can take for free. Because now we can flip. Now we can flip. Yep. Ooh, he put my Gohan in rest mode. What is he doing? Oh, he's locking down my Gohan. That's okay, though. That's all right, because he doesn't know what we have up our sleeve. He doesn't know what we have up our sleeve. Goldo is such a weird play. Yeah, that's fine. Flip. Uh-oh. It just got real, baby. It just got real. So he's at 25. We can choose. What is this? Oh, yeah. We can just. He's attacked with everything, right? He just chose victory. Oh, he surrendered. <laughs> he just doesn't have a way to deal with us, man. I love it. Well, there you go, guys. That's the uh, the strength of green. That is the strength of green. But yeah, guys, Gohan, super strong, super versatile, just like most of the green decks that are at top of the meta right now. So if you guys did enjoy today's video, make sure to drop a like. Don't forget to comment down below what do you guys think. We got set two coming up in 13 days, which I'm super excited about. Or no, actually 11 days, I believe. So I'm super excited about that. Um, try to get this video to 25 likes, guys. I'd really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, stay gaming. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.